Question 11, Part F. A recent census found that 30% of Australians were born overseas. A sample of 900 randomly selected Australians were surveyed. Let P hat be the sample proportion of the surveyed people who were born overseas. A normal distribution is to be used to approximate the probability that the sample proportion is less than or equal to 0.31. Part 1. Show that the variance of the random variable P hat is 7 over 30,000. The variance of the sample proportion p hat is given by the formula p times q divided by n, where p is the population proportion, q is the complement of the population proportion given by 1 minus p, and n is the sample size. So in this case, the population proportion is 30% or 0.3, q is 1 minus 0.3, which is 0.7, and n is 900. So the variance of p hat equals 0 0.3 times 0 0.7 divided by 900 as a fraction that's 7 over 30,000 as required. Part 2. Use the standard normal distribution and the information on page 16 to approximate the probability that the sample proportion is less than or equal to 0.31, giving your answer correct to two decimal places. The mean mu is equal to the population proportion p, which is equal to 0.3. Now the standard deviation sigma is equal to the square root of the variance that we found in part 1, which is the square root of 7 over 30,000. And as a decimal, that's approximately equal to 0 0.015275 and so on. Next, we need to work out the z-score that corresponds to p hat equals 0 0.31. Using the z-score formula, that is raw score or actual score minus mu in brackets divided by the standard deviation, so that's 0 0.31 minus 0 0.3 in brackets divided by 0 0.015275 and so on, or dividing by the exact value, the square root of 7 over 30,000, we get 0 0.65 correct to two decimal places. Now the probability that the sample proportion, p hat, is less than or equal to 0 0.31 is approximately equal to the probability that the corresponding z score is less than or equal to 0 0.65. And from the table of z-scores, the probability that z is less than or equal to 0 0.65 is equal to 0 0.7422. So here's the table of z-scores. And just locating 0 0.65. So here's 0 0.6. And if we go across to the column that's 0 0.05, we get to this value here. And that's how we obtain 0.7422 from the table of z-scores. Therefore, the probability that the sample proportion is less than or equal to 0.31 is approximately equal to 0.7422, which equals 0.74 correct to two decimal places.